The most important initial assessment in the suspicion of an ectopic pregnancy is the A to E assessment. If the patient is unstable and there's a clinical suspicion on history or exam of an ectopic, do not delay treatment. Other important tests that will diagnose an ectopic and also guide treatment is the transvaginal ultrasound and serum HCG blood test. If the patient is in significant pain or clinically unstable, the patient is indicated for gynae surgery, a salpingectomy or a salpingotomy. Additionally, if the ultrasound or blood test shows a mass larger than 35 millimeters, fetal heartbeat or an HCG greater than 5000, this also indicates surgery. Now, if the patient doesn't fit into any of this, but the HCG is greater than 1,500, this indicates medical management with the teratogen, methotrexate. And if HCG is less than 1,500, but still raised over baseline, this indicates expectant management. The patient can be sent home and the body may naturally absorb the ectopic pregnancy. But important to know that in both medical and conservative management, as you can imagine, it's important to regularly follow up the patient.